Hi, Charlie here. Today we're going to talk about when a DWI is a felony in Texas. And we're going to be referring to the third degree felony, which is a DWI where there are two prior convictions. And I mention that because there is a state jail felony of a DWI with a child passenger. We're not talking about that today. We're talking about this third degree felony with two prior convictions. Now let me show you the different scenarios. Scenario one, and this is the fairly typical way it works, you've got an arrest, a conviction, a second arrest, another conviction, and then the third arrest is a felony. Okay, nothing tricky about that. Scenario number two, though, we've got an arrest and then the case is dismissed. Okay, and so this DWI arrest is not going to count. And let me show you how that works. So the next arrest is the misdemeanor, then you've got a conviction, and the next arrest is considered a misdemeanor second, and then a conviction, and then finally you've got the third degree felony arrest. But as you can see, that's the fourth, technically, DWI arrest. But, but there's only two prior convictions. All right, the third scenario is a little trickier. Okay, now let's say we have a DWI first arrest and then a conviction. And then we've got a second DWI arrest. But before that one's resolved, they get another DWI. So they've got what we call multiple pending. Now, that second second, okay, is still considered a misdemeanor because there isn't two prior convictions. There's only one prior conviction. But now, if he gets another one, a conviction, a second one, on either one of those cases, the next one would be a felony. All right, and finally, I want to talk about the just the possible results on a felony DWI in, in Texas. First is two to ten years in prison. Okay, that's the worst case scenario. And then two to ten years of probation. Okay, that's certainly possible. They can reduce it down to a misdemeanor, uh, depending on the facts or, or you know what the prosecutors feel is appropriate. You can have a jury trial, of course, um, and they can dismiss the case um, if the prosecutors decide that the evidence isn't there or there's some other reason to do that. All right, I hope that helps you understand uh, when a DWI is a felony in Texas. Mm -hmm.